Good afternoon, guys. Yeah, this was a family vacation that ended in the worst way. There is video of eight-year-old George Brewer plummeting 24 feet from the top of a climbing frame down to the ground below over at Navy Pier over the summer. We're not going to show you that video in full because it is extremely tough to watch and to hear that child hit the ground. Now, George had been in the climbing frame the day before with his six-year-old twin brothers. The boys loved it and they wanted to go back again on the evening of July 27th. It was the end of the night around nine o'clock. We're told the employees at the attraction gave George the go-ahead to start off on the wall but as George hit the timer at the top and let go to rappel down his parents Aaron and Gideon who were watching and cheering him on realized something was terribly terribly wrong their little boy was left with multiple broken bones he even spent the next two months in a wheelchair but in those initial moments after the fall they thought they had lost him altogether and he was completely lifeless. Um, after he hit the ground, it was silent. And when I saw him, he was, he was unconscious. Um, he was covered in blood. And we did, we thought, and it, it's so hard to say that, but we really did think he was dead. It felt like our entire life was over. I mean, hindsight's 2020, but I mean, for every parent out there that's taking their kids to Navy Pier or anywhere else for that matter, I mean, you have to, be an advocate for your child and make sure that the people that are doing what they say they're doing are actually doing it. Now, the family has filed a 10-count lawsuit against Navy Pier, saying that basic safety precautions and protocols were not followed. They say there wasn't even padding at the bottom of the climbing frame to help cushion that little boy's fall. We're told there is a federal recommendation to provide padding at attractions like this, but the lawyers for the family say that clearly was not followed. We have reached out to Navy Pier today for comment, and they've declined to speak with us. We're live downtown. Ronald Tumulty. WGN News.